All right, so I wanted to show everyone uh, uh, different advertising advertisements I'm running uh, for my various campaigns. So when I enter Color Central, I just went to advertising and then click on campaign manager. This kind of pulls up all the different uh, campaigns I've been running. So I'm doing a test. See when you set up when you create a campaign. Um, I'll just show you real quick. Um, after you name it, you get two choices. You can do automatic targeting or manual targeting. So automatic targeting, Amazon just kind of takes care of what they kind of read the buy page and kind of decide what keywords to target. Manual targeting, you get to choose uh, what keywords you want to pay to target. So I'm kind of running identical campaigns for my soap mold one using auto and one using non-auto. Um, and then uh, over here, you kind of put in your daily budget, your start and stop date, and then this is where uh, they collect all your stats. So kind of how much money you, you spent, how, many, how, you know, how much sales you've done, and then what percentage of your spend equals your sales. Um, so you actually want this number to be what I understand low the lower the the lower the better um, so just looking through real quick the other thing I've noticed is that this is really slow to update and maybe not 100% accurate the reason I'm uh, I'm saying that is because for example on the apricots I've had apricots up for almost a week without any sales, then I started running a campaign, and next thing I know, um, scrolling down, I've sold two apricots today, even though it's not recording in my campaign manager. And I don't know if that's just because it's on a delay, or it's really hard for Amazon to keep track of when they click on your ad and then they buy something, and how that works. The other thing I've noticed is the exact same thing with soap molds, as you can see, I, you know, I have one cell attributed to a campaign ad, and then zero on the other. But looking at my inventory, scrolling up to my soap molds right here, um, you know, I this is the one I I originally had thirty, now I have twenty nine. That was attributed to one advertisement but then I look at this six count and it says I have five in reserve even though it's not counting any of them towards the ads I sold and once again I had these up for you know over five days without any sales and without any traffic now I'm getting traffic and getting sales even though it's not necessarily counting so although my stats say they're not working necessarily for some reason, you know, my sales say otherwise that they are working. So that's good to see. I, you know, I was very skeptical that any kind of Amazon ads would work. Um, and just to show you, uh, let's see if I can make one of them pop up. So one of the keywords I'm tar targeting is soap molds. So when people, if they were search soap molds, you know, here's my one ad appearing sponsored on the side. Um, then another place will also appear is on the bottom. So there's my uh, same ad, but on the bottom. And it clearly says sponsored. But what I like about that is basically I'm, I'm paying money to uh, get on the first search, search page. And although it's the sponsored, you know, consumers might not necessarily care. Um, and so. Uh, I once again, the stats say it's not causing sales, but I'm obviously making sales. The only difference between today and five days ago, or for the past five days, is that I've been running ads. Um, the other thing about ads is that you only pay by click. So even though people can see this ad, they're not. Uh, I don't pay for it, although they do. Um, count that uh, in your stack. So when you click in, you can see how many impressions it got and then how many clicks 
it got. Um, and although I have my default bid set at 25 cents, I don't necessarily pay 25 cents. Um, so right now I'm paying roughly about 10 cents a click, a little, um, a little under 10 cents um, a click. But I'm not paying for the impressions, which is nice. This also gives me an idea of how many people search for those keywords. And that's, you know, that's a lot of traffic right there um, to be able to get that many impressions. So I, I'm happy about that. 